What's up? It's Lover J. Three minutes from the 25360, but right now we're in the 206. And uh, we just finished with the Rise and Decolonize celebration here at Westlake Center, downtown Seattle. I'm here with the co host of the event and the Seattle hip hop pioneer and luminary, MC Extraordinaire from Silent Lambs with Black Stacks. I'm here with Jace. EKs, let me get you. Yes, sir. What's up? What's you up? Know, How'd it go, man? How oh, was it? Was it? Beautiful, man. It was in the movement and spirit of hip hop. You got to see the elders. You got to see the youth. What does that mean in the spirit of hip hop? People don't even. What does hip hop mean now? Well, I mean, hip hop means now the same thing as it meant then. Okay. You know, hip hop went against the grain. Hip hop was a protest. It spoke against the things that were injustices that were happening in the neighborhoods, in the communities. You know, now this rap culture has become popular. So people think because you're a rapper that means you're in hip-hop that's not how it goes break it down for me one time i'll break it down for you one time they say there's four elements of hip-hop they say there's djing the beat the heartbeat the drum the sound they say there's rapping or the words the emotions they're the voices of the people they said there's dance which is the expression of the people through movement and action and there's also visual graffiti they get so people can see they can witness you can take the pictures it's like the hieroglyphs right. and rap name me four elements that make a rap there's not four elements that make a rap might be four genres okay but there's not four elements okay so you was you was on on stage spitting at the end and uh spitting some knowledge and some words and you were talking about hip-hop and what that means and what does it mean as we're talking today you said hip-hop began from protest what do you mean by that what does that mean for tonight well i mean tonight spoke to a lot of things it showed that there's continual struggle that's happening in this country some people are now taking heed of it because they are struggling we've been struggling for many many years and when i say hip-hop comes from protest we've been speaking about this for 35 years in hip-hop we've been talking about all these things health care education Education, economics, uh, voice in politics, um, uh, housing. We've been speaking on these things for years. So now America is here, the world is here, and now we're all speaking the same language. 99% of us are speaking the same language. So time is here. All right, all right. That's my man right here, Big Jace. When you see him, when you hear the Silent Lambs is playing or Black Stacks is playing, get your butt down to the show and support please, and please get a do. taste of some of the soul that still exists in hip-hop. Yes, indeed. Three minutes from the 25360.